And as that chur storm churns north, parts of the mid-state are preparing for potential flooding. Local leaders are now working to prevent that possibility. Sarah Wilson joins us live in our studio with more. Sarah. Alicia, Valerie, different public works departments across central PA are going around cleaning the leaves out of storm drains so they don't clog and flood the streets. But now they're asking for your help. As now Tropical Storm Nicole heads for the Mid-Atlantic, officials across the Mid-State are getting ready. The Public Works Department has been working overtime this week to clean up the leaves throughout the city. The reason for that, the rain. If the inlets get, get clogged, then the flooding will be massive quickly versus going into the system before it floods. About three quarters of the 3,000 storm drains in Harrisburg have been cleaned out in the past two days using leaf vacs, which officials say is crucial to keeping water levels down because if those drains aren't cleared, the water will no longer be able to get through this graded area and then it will have to find another lease path of resistance which is usually over the curb or down someone's driveway, something of that nature. The most vulnerable areas are the ones at the bottom of large hills. We'll have crews on standby to handle incidences as needed. The Public Works Department now asking for your help to keep the storm drains clear of leaves, trash, and any other debris. Keep as much as you can, maybe up on top of your curb line, not in the gutter line of the road. And most importantly, they say if there's flooding, stay away. You don't know what's underwater. You don't know if there's breaks in the road, the cause of the flooding. You don't know how deep it is. And a lot of times people panic. And when you panic, you do you make bad decisions. So it's important to not even try it. Turn around, go the other way. That's what's important. Some good advice there. Now, for some reason, your road does flood. You can call the Public Works Department. We have their information on our website. In the studio, Sarah Wilson, ABC 27 News. Alicia. Sarah, thanks so much.